mining is uh, having a huge impact in uh, uh, in uh, some of the uh, coal belts, uh, especially in Garo Hills. Uh, it uh, it occurs in uh, south and east Garo Hills. So there, where the mining takes place, a uh, lot of deforestation has also taken place. That is unfortunate. They dig holes in the earth. So uh, sometimes, we, we, if they find that uh, a tree is standing just over a coal uh, seam, then they will cut down the tree and they will mine there. And also sometimes because of the unscientific mining, landslips occur. Landslips, so along with the landslip, all the trees that are there, they also uh, fall apart. So these things like uh, not only deforest the land, but because of mining, this land will never grow back. The trees will not grow back on this land because it's polluted and sometimes it's hollow. It has been dug and no one fills it up. <laughs> Whatever comes out from the mine spreads around the area and <clears throat> this pollute the area so trees can't grow in that area and again this goes with the rainwater into the rivers and it, it uh, the rivers become inhospitable for the fishes so the fishes dies out a few uh, individuals have the license for coal mining but majority of them don't uh, and the coal mining is one of the subjects of the center and the state uh, but it has not been uh, we have not been empowered to uh, you know, look into coal. But uh, of course, uh, environment as a whole is our also our subject. So we could have taken uh, this thing. But uh, as I said earlier, uh, because of uh, dearth of funds and also manpower, it is uh, a little difficult to tackle the, the problem. But I I I am quite sure if uh, uh, we can stop the mining at a certain point of time, we can uh, you know uh, aid the environment to grow back into its original uh, state.